the gap between the two COVID-19 vaccine doses has now been reduced to around a month. But some who had to previously wait up to four months to get their second shot are concerned about the level of protection they have. In this week's COVID-19 Q&A with Toronto's Associate Medical Officer of Health, a viewer asked if those who got their two shots four months apart are as protected from COVID-19 as those who had just the one-month gap. So we actually know that the second shot, no matter what the interval is, gives you a boost to response. Except for looking at some of the studies that have been done, again, it's all about balancing the risk. And right now we're recommending that shorter interval. Remember, we only extended that interval because we didn't have a lot of vaccine. It was really because of vaccine supply. Now we actually have enough vaccine supply so we can give a shorter interval. And we have the Delta variant where we know that you really need those two doses to get the best protection. And so that's why we're recommending that shorter interval. So, you know, as we've talked about, if you could extend that interval six weeks, eight weeks, it might give you a slightly better immune response, but then you're more at risk for, for Delta while you're waiting. And so that's why we're recommending that shorter interval now, especially because we have vaccine supply too. In terms of comparisons, I waited six weeks, somebody else waited two months. I don't necessarily have better protection than the person who waited two months. It's, it, you said the second dose boosts it no matter what, right? That's right. That's right. So you would, by the time you get your second dose, you will have a strong boosted immune response. This week, we also spoke about second vaccine doses for those who have already had COVID-19 and travel post-vaccination. For the full chat and to submit your questions for our next Q&A, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash COVID answers. You can also access the page by scanning the QR code on your screen. For City News, I'm Dilshad Berman.